Tak nak kira lawa yang mula. What are you doing? See, it's gubot with or without me. Che, ay padre yata tanawa ko. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can eat. You can soup soup. Like, mommy, this is not like. I know yesterday I said that I would be doing a beauty unboxing for you guys, but I think it's so much more interesting for me to try out these products instead. So I'm going to be doing that today, showing you exactly how these products apply, and if you want to get them, I'll put swipe up links too. Okay, first up, this didn't arrive in the mail. I actually got it myself. It is the Take A Layer 3CE. I've really been enjoying this product. Okay, I was going to get a brush, but now I'm just going to show you with my hand. And I love how this looks because it's so natural, especially when you're not wearing any makeup. Like, I'm not wearing any makeup right now. Um, it just needs a little bit of time blending if you put on a bit of product, like I did. But look how natural that looks. One cheek has it, and the other cheek, I'm gonna go in with a brush. I love it, super natural finish. Okay, this is something that just arrived. It's from Tevion. It is the Eyebrow Tint. And I haven't tried this out before, but let me open it up and show you guys what's inside. And let's try it out together today. Looks like this. Wow. Oh, it's the one with the three prong, like pen eyeliner type. So yeah, let me try it out. Before we try it out on the brows, let's try it out on the hand. You can actually draw hair on your brows. Let's try it out. Ooh, look at that. Supernatural. Whoa. That's cool. Okay, let's try the other side. Um, hard for me to make it straight because I'm using the camera, but look. That's so cool. Let me try it out on this, like, area here. It needs a little bit of help. Whoa. That looks pretty good. I usually extend here. Not bad, guys. All right, this just arrived. It is the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder. It comes in this holiday packaging, and this is what is inside. So it's the same one as their classic, which is really good, but because I still have a little tiny pot here, I do not want to open this up yet because it's cyan. So I'm just going to show you guys how this one applies because it's the exact same product anyway. I'm taking a little bit onto a brush. I'm just going to lightly dust that off. You know what I don't understand is how those Instagram girls can go about their day without putting powder on, especially if they put on concealer or foundation. I just feel like it makes my face so sticky and my hair is just sticking all over the place, so I really need powder. I don't know how they do it. They look glossy, but I feel like it's very, not practical if you're living in a tropical country. So I always like to go in with a loose powder. Okay, let's do eyeshadow for a bit of fun. This is the Tevion Senorita palette. They also just sent this over. 
but I already have one, so I'm gonna use the old one. And the colors are super duper festive. I think it's perfect for the holidays. I think I'm gonna go in with the color Fantasia, this one over here. I'm just gonna use my finger and swipe that on. And I love the pigment of this. It applies so easily. It's like really creamy. It's not the powdery type where you apply it and then it just falls down. It has like excessive fallout. It's nothing like that. It's really creamy, guys, like a cream powder-ish. And look how easy that blends with just a finger. In case you're wondering, Scott is napping, which is why I have all the time in the world. Not all the time in the world, but probably the next 10, 15 minutes to do this for you guys. I miss doing my makeup. And it's so easy to just blend it all up. I'm concentrating the pigment on the bottom and just slowly swiping that up. I don't know if you can see it on cam, I'm just using my iPhone, but it's chromatic. Amazing. Okay, since we're using um, eyeshadow today, let's go in with my fave eyeliner. This is the Mersey First Gel Eyeliner. I love this one. It just glides on so easily. And usually when I apply this, I do it like this, tight lining. So I don't go in with mascara anymore because I'm lazy and I'm just at home anyways. But when you do go in with mascara and you have this on, it just makes your lash line look so, so full. So after I put this on, I will put eyeshadow on top of it just to kind of layer it and make it look a little bit smoky. So let's go back in on this palette and use the Milan shade and just kind of smoke that out. Because we're already here, let's go in with the inner corners. Laura Mercier Caviar Stick Holiday Packaging. This is their Ballet à Paris collection. I just watched Emily in Paris last night. Um, no brainer show makes you feel good. Ooh, uh, it comes with mascara. It's a duo. It's a duo. Okay, so maybe we will try mascara out today. This is a mini. Okay, inner corners. Whoa. Nice. Just going to blend that out. Very festive. Ooh, me likey. I love it. This is good. Mascara time, moment of truth. Don't judge my lashes. They are Chinese lashes. Very slick, straight, and short. But let's see if this can add a bit of volume. Also, I am like super picky when it comes to mascara. So if I like this, and I do, doesn't really apply too thick. It's like a thin layer. So the curl like lasts. You know how if your lashes are super slick straight um, and you apply a heavy mascara on top of it, they just fall down? That is not happening now. Although I didn't really curl it that much, so you can't see now it's super curled, but not bad. Okay, last but not least, we are going in with Sunny's Face Lip Treat. I already put this shade on. It's the shade Chill. I'll show you again. Honestly, this is, oh my gosh, it's super surprising because I love it. Not surprising because I love the Sunny's Face products, but it's really good, like definitely one of my faves. My, my lips feel hydrated and there's a little bit of color on them, not too intense, so that if you're not wearing any makeup, it doesn't look weird. And then I'm gonna go in with Poppy just to see. Fresh, I love it. Okay, that is it for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed videos like this, then let me know if you want me to do more. If you want it on my stories or if you want it on IGTV or if you want it on YouTube, let me know so I can film more for you guys when I have time. And thank you so much for watching again.